Hey, Fresh Start fam. Welcome to April's Fresh Start Budgets, where budgeting doesn't have to be intimidating, and every day is a new opportunity to make a fresh start with financial decisions that'll help you win with money. If you're new here, hi, my name is April, and if you're familiar with my channel, welcome back. I'm so glad to have all of you here. Okay, so how was everybody's Christmas? Mine was absolutely fantastic. It was wonderful spending time with the family. Um, my mom actually got me this nail polish for Christmas and I couldn't wait to put it on. It is like a crackle effect. The nude color that's underneath there is really pretty even on its own. And then you put a top coat on and it crackles and it kind of makes this like leopard effect. So I thought that was pretty neat. My mom knows my style very well and that was one of the gifts that she gave me and I couldn't wait to put it on so I did that today. So in today's video we should be doing the last billing period, billing cycle one, which is the last paycheck for December, but actually I did not prep for that. Um, so I will be filming that one later this week, just a few days late, but actually what I did want to film today was some happy mail. And then I also wanted to let you guys know that after we paid off the credit card that we had our vacation charges on, cause we left, we went on a cruise last month and any charges that were done on the ship, you have to have a credit card registered to. So once we were able to square that away and make the payments, we did come home with some extra money, actually quite a bit extra. We didn't do as much alcoholic adult beverages on the ship as we thought we would. My husband tends to like the sweeter, fruitier drinks, and we really couldn't find too many of those. Or um, Maybe we just really weren't in the mood. Like I said, we've been pursuing a more healthy lifestyle lately. So we actually really weren't necessarily in the mood to drink as much on the ship. So that's no problem because we came home with a bunch of extra cash. So let's first start with our happy mail. So I ordered a ton of stuff lately and this one came from our good friend, Save with Judy. Thank you so much to Save with Judy for the shout out that she gave me on her channel. I am so excited. I got a lot of viewers from that shout out, so I greatly appreciate it. I am so excited about this one. This is a Save the Color. So what we have here is we have two dice. We have one that will give the color and then one will give a number. And what we'll do is we will save the number that it comes up on and we'll try to fill this board up. So that is so exciting here. And then this is super cute. Bring on the new year. Each hat will be a make up your own. That is a nice one. Oh, and save with Judy, got some stickers here. How cute. Let's check these out. Oh, have a scratch on me. That is so cute. Aw, oh, what a cute little chipmunk. Thank you so much, Judy. I actually got a few. I got a couple that I need to download and print out. One that I actually already did download and print out. And um, a few others that I need to print out and I got so many savings challenges lately that actually what I decided to do in the new year is do a few of our sinking funds. I actually did hear Miss Judy say this on her channel that it is way more fun to save for sinking funds with savings challenges. So not only because of that, but also because of I, I have so, I went on an Etsy binge lately. I have so many savings challenges. There's been so many great holiday sales and so many amazing YouTubers coming out with so many things that I decided to buy a whole bunch of savings challenges. I probably need to do an Etsy no spend in the new year. I probably will do something like that. And there's been some great YouTubers that have been giving away some free savings challenges on their websites or their Google Docs. So... I think what we will do is in the new year, we will save for some of the things that are longer term, like my son's tuition, vacation, Christmas, that type of thing. So I think what we'll do is we'll make games out of those. And instead of just putting the dedicated like 200 in there, 300 in there, 100 in there, we'll make games out of those. And then at the end of the month, we'll see 
how much we can put into each of those categories. So let's first do some savings challenges with the leftover vacation money that we have here. And let's actually see how much we have on this total so far. We have 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 600, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74. Okay, so we have $674 in order to put into some savings challenges. Leftover from the vacation. I wasn't sure whether I was going to actually just all put this in the new mattress fund or whether I was going to put it in the emergency fun fun but I figured with all the new savings challenges that I got let's end 2023 with a bang and do some of those so let's get started so some of the savings challenges that I got I got this one from save with Judy also this was a freebie that she had in her google docs and this is a $25 a month and it's all for all of 2024. So I thought this one would be a great way to start saving for Christmas of 2024. And so what I would do is I would roll a dice and I would do, uh, it's $5 each icon. So I would roll a dice and see how many uh, icons I get that week. So let's go ahead and start on this one. All right, so let's start and see how many we get for the first. Four, okay. So we have one, two, three, four. So that is $20 going in our 2024. That is not a bad way to start 2024. All right, so that one is all set. Thank you so much for, to Save with Judy for this freebie. We love that. The next one is from Jan at Country Girl Budgets, and this is another 2024, Happy New Year 2024. This is a $100 total, so let us see how many of these we can do today. We'll do two of these, so let's do, let's do the 6 and the 14 for an even 20. 6 and 14. That'll be 420. Awesome. This is another freebie from Jan at Country Girl Budgets. I'll have her uh, YouTube link down below where you can get this freebie as well. Okay, so the next one is from, I believe it is Honey Honeydew Budgets. Um, I'll have the Etsy link down below, but I was able to get this and it's for the full year. Every month is $500. So I have January here on the back. I have February and then I made the envelope myself. It was typically going to be like a paper envelope, but I made the envelope so that I could put it in my savings challenge binder and it's say January on one side and I put February on the other side. All right, so I'm going to roll the dice and we'll see how many of these we have to do as well. Oh, just one. Okay, so let's do, since we have a lot, let's do a big one. Let's do the 55. Okay. So we'll do 20, 40, 50, I was thinking I was going to do more on that one, but that's okay. We'll get it all done eventually. Okay, the next one that I got is the Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. This is from Sons and Roses. I thought this one looks so much fun. I actually put the envelope in here in my savings challenge binder, so I will be able to keep that squared away. 
and then I will add the other envelopes as soon as I get them sorted. So let's go ahead and roll the dice and see how many, each of these are $20. So we could be saving 20 or we could be saving uh, whatever math is, 120 today. Three, so we are gonna save 60. So we have 20, 40, 60. 20, 40, 60. All right, so let's put that away in there. Okay, the next one is one of the downloads that I got from uh, Save with Judy. This is for my son's tuition. So each icon is going to be $60, and then I will roll and see how many icons we are going to save. I know this one, I had to write a cheat sheet on the back. So if I roll a one, I save 60. If I roll a two, 120, and all the way up to $360 a month. So that is a lot, but typically we're actually putting about 250, I believe, away onto that category. So I figured it'll offset some months, it'll be bigger, some months it'll be smaller. So let's go ahead and see how many we're gonna do on this one. Five. Oh, it's a big one. Okay, so today we are doing 300 in there. Actually, let's do, go ahead and do this one in a cuter color. I got some new Sharpies. So let's go ahead. One of the colors at my son's school is yellow. Okay, so let's go ahead and color this in in yellow. We will do five of them. All right, and let's do our 300. So we have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300. Awesome, great start on that one. Thank you so much to Judy for this. I'll have her Etsy shop linked down below where you can download this for yourself as well. Okay, and then the last one that I wanna do is at least maybe second to last, is the birthday. This again, I mentioned in another previous video, my oldest son is turning 21 this year. And so this savings challenge, we could save up to $300 and this will go towards my oldest son's birthday. So let's see how many of these we're gonna fill out today. Just one, oh no. All right, so let's do, let's go big and we'll do a 20. And then since we have plenty of extra money, what we'll do is we'll do our Wizard of Oz challenge. Like I said, guys, I went nuts. This is another one from Sons and Roses. So this is the yellow brick road. So I'll use our yellow Sharpie again, and we will see how many of these we can fill in. Most likely today we'll be starting at the bottom. We'll do two. So we have 70 and 69 for a total of 139. At the end of this, you will save 2,485. That is so cool. All right, so we have 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Then I need another 39. All right, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, and then we have 36, 37, 38, and 39. Perfect. All right. So let's put this in there. All right. Let's see how much we have left over today. We have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Okay. So let's actually go to one of our other savings challenges that we have been doing on our regular savings challenge day. And let's do our Happy New Year 2024. All right, so let's see. Let's roll the dice and see. Five. All right, 
One, two, three, four, five. Twenty-four. One, two, or sorry, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. Maybe I will need to make change. One, let's see if we get another one. Oh, that one is another five. One, two, three, four, five. We'll go up here today. Okay, that is a four. So we have 28 total. I do need to make change. So one minute while I do that. Okay, so now we need 24 plus four for 28. So we have five, 10, 15, 20, 25. What do we need here? Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. Okay, there it is. So that's how much we have so far. Let's see if we have enough to even roll one more time. We have five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Okay, we have enough to roll one more time. Five. Oh, all the fives today. All right. Five. One, two, three, four, five. And this is another four. So let's do that one back. We'll get that one there. And let's see, do we have enough to roll one more time? 15, 20. Yes, we do. Okay, one more time. One. All right, let's go back up here. And this is 20. Okay, great. So we have 5, 10, 15, 20. Okay. So today we are adding 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, and 2. So 52 to this savings challenge. Let me move that over so I don't get confused. So to total we have in this savings challenge, we have, we're doing really good on this one. I am so excited about that. So we have 120, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200, 1, 2, 3, 4. All right, 204, and then remember, guys, this is a $300 savings challenge, so we are two-thirds of the way there. That is awesome. I am so excited about that. All right, the last one that we will do today will be our rainy day fund. Let me see if I can get the Sharpie for that one. It's a different color, but that's okay. And we have how many fives left? We have one five left, so we'll do that one five. We'll throw that one in here, okay? And then our last singles will go in this box. So this box is any money that I have left over from doing savings challenges that I don't have enough to complete another round of a savings challenge will go in here. Once this box is completely filled up, we will smash it. There is no cork or any way to open this without actually smashing it. So we will smash it and then count up how much we have at the end once it's completely full and then do another mass savings challenge kind of like we did today. All right, so there is how much money going in here. One, two, three dollars going in this box. Okay, got a good start on that one so far. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up subscribe, comment, hit that bell for notifications so you can see all the fun that we're going to have in 2024. And thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good night.